When the time is right and I'm not alone, I will conquer this and bring you home. When this world has stopped and the breeze is served, when the time is right, I'll sing you a song. going on guys it's a new day it's a new car gone is the chevy bolt and to replace it is the 2019 hyundai santa fe it's an suv it's red like the bolt it's not electric totally you know gas powered and i'm poking this puppy all the way out to the valley because today i'm going to go on the radio with bob beck and the group from Gas. It's a cool radio show, and uh, by the time this comes out, I'll have done a Facebook Live already, and then we'll have a good time on the radio. We'll be talking about all kinds of fun stuff. Hey everybody, it's Sunrun Bob. We're here in the studio, and I've got Ray Meeker doing and Fireball. There's Fireball. Oh, it? Fireball. Yeah, there he is. There's Tim. You're doing you're you're cool. He's he's videoing and I'm videoing and we're videoing <laughs> each other videoing. I'm the only one not being videoed, but no. actually I am being videoed. You're not, not the only one who Okay, wait a minute. Wait, wait just put it together. Alright, here we go. I like putting doing mine sideways. Okay, there you go. There you go. I can do mine sideways without everyone being looking at it sideways, see? Yeah, there you oh. go, see? <laughs> Straight down. I don't know. See? This is us. We're trying to vlog. It's, it's not working. This is what a news conference is going to be in one. years to come. In fact, next Thursday. We're about ready to start. Oh, we're, we're a minute away. So if you want to watch us more, uh, I, I always like the red, white, and blue striping. But this one was painted exactly the way the Trans Am car was. This is a 1970 you're seeing now. Yeah. I, I love that design because it really takes the best of the original. Yeah. And it adds a little bit of a different front grille to it. It stands out a little bit more. But again, it, the fact that they put a, were able to put an airflow in there and the whole mm -hmm. thing, it just, it just looks great. And then that
from uh, after the radio show. Uh, we are driving the 2019 Hyundai Santa Fe. What do you think? I, actually, I forgot to look around. <laughs> Kathy rarely uh, notices that the cars change so rapidly. I know. She just kind of gets in and we go and she doesn't say a word. It's like, oh, it's an SUV or oh, it's a, it's a sports car. That's why I can't find it when I come out of the grocery store. Your hair looks very glamorous today. Oh, thank you. It's hard to keep track of it all. There's there's just a lot of stuff happening here on the blog here at Fireball Publishing. And uh, one of the things is the, the Hyundai that came in, but uh, something else is coming in tomorrow. 
Oh my God. And what it is, is going to be revealed uh, very shortly this weekend on Saturday. I'll be at the Classic Auto Show, which is gonna be a spectacular show. I'm gonna be driving something in the neighborhood of a 500 horsepower something or other, taking that to that show. And then Sunday's Wheels and Waves, I'll have this, this epic ride. <sighs> such is life. But let's talk a little bit about uh, the Hyundai because that's what we want to focus on for today's episode. Uh, Hyundai sent over this SUV and uh, it's been around for a while. It's gotten some upgrades as far as the, the looks, uh, the design, and, and the, the exterior certainly is the best part of the car. The interior, it's pretty good. The interior I, I like uh, quite a bit. Uh, uh, some of the details, the seats feel a little flat to me. It's not, they don't, they're not as comfortable. They don't kind of cup your, your tush in the way that I would like to be cupped. But the exterior, the exterior is very nice. The, the only issue I have with this car is the, the performance. Um, it's a little twitchy. It's a little bit, uh, you know, if you're cruising along, let's say around 40, and then you floor it, it spends a full second thinking about what it is that you're trying to tell it to do. Should I turn on the radio? Should I do this? Should I do that? Before it realizes that it should accelerate, which is why you press the pedal. That's the whole point of the pedal. There's a serious delay going on there. They need to fix that, uh, need to address that. But this Hyundai, uh, the ultimate, uh, Santa Fe Ultimate 2.0, 2 it's all wheel drive. It gets about 21 miles per gallon, so it's not, not, not as good as it could be. I, I think it could be a little bit more efficient than that. But I wouldn't be surprised if this is kind of the last gen of this particular model. As they've done a, quite a, a number of, of design upgrades and it's it's time for a fresh one. And all that red, all that red wrapped up into a package that's approximately $39,000. 40,000, 40,000 for this SUV. It does ev pretty much everything an SUV does. Uh, it's just, um, it's starting to feel a little bit a, bit, a little bit clunky, a little bit old. So uh, those upgrades are gonna be coming soon. This one is in lava orange. I like the name, I like the name. Hold on a second. Hyundai, I like the name, lava orange. Yep, let's keep that. Okay, good, thanks. What else, what else, what else? What Currently else? working on the Porsche book. Now, if you've been watching Art Talk, our new show, which is a live show on Facebook Live, that show airs every day at 8 a.m. It's different from the vlog because it's it's more getting focused on, on helping people to be creative and, and to be powerful within their own skin. Don't worry, the vlog is not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. Still closing in on a thousand episodes. We're going a little bit slower, but that's okay. There's still lots of content, lots of things to be able to put out there. But we are working on the Porsche book. That's the next book that's coming April 1st. As long as my head doesn't explode, that's what the focus is. Kathy is working on her next book, which comes out the month after that, and that is The History of Surfing. But I'm anxious. I'm anxious. I'm, I'm excited about this weekend's show, the Classic Auto Show. I'm going to be able to see a lot of you guys there, hang out with everybody, going to be vlogging, so make sure to wear some snappy. And we just got confirmation. It looks like actor Michael Madsen is going to be joining us at Wheels and Waves for this month's show. He and his son are going to be bringing a couple of Mustangs. I think that's what the deal is. Not 100% sure. It's going to be kind of a surprise. But if you plan on going to the Classic Auto Show on Sunday and you're coming from the north, stop by Wheels and Waves. Get some free coffee. Get some you know, some free Hot Wheels. All right. That's all I got for today's vlog. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate you guys joining me. I want you to come and visit us on Art Talk, 8 o'clock every weekday morning on Facebook Live. Come hang out. Uh, you can interact. It's live, which is really cool. So you get a chance to not only talk to me, ask me some questions, but you can interact with each other and maybe you could help other people. That's the plan, man. That's what we're doing. 